unfold uh, for Modi's narrative of that he's actually doing a, 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 favor, one, to them, a really. favor to them, exactly. Yeah. You know the term they're using for this? Protective curfew. Okay. And somebody uh, on the social media said, what exactly is protective curfew? And some of these, uh, and I'm talking about these uh, Indian journalists and, and other public intellectuals who said that it was important, otherwise people could have gotten killed. Now, the question arises, what exactly is the situation where you thought that people could get killed? And therefore, you needed to have this quote-unquote protective curfew mm -hmm. and an absolute blanket communication mm -hmm. blackout. Which in this day, and, and you know, Reuters had this um, story today about uh, what they call called a death and a birth. Okay. So there's this one person who lay dying, and there was another person who was running to try and get help for his wife, who was in a family way, mm. who gave birth. So there's a death and a birth. Mm. And to me, it is also uh, a metaphor for what's happening uh, in the valley. Because history is the logic of might. We know that. But history is also the story of people's struggles right. for their right to self-determination. Right. It may take a very long time. It's likely to take a very long time. Mm -hmm. But this is not something that you can suppress right. ad infinitum. It's, it's just fact, not going to happen.